just look at that carnage and I challenge myself to go there and do and lie down and start talking on the camera and with that carnage and I'm like what did I why why did I say that I've been here for over 10 minutes just trying to find out how to do this and I'm just gonna go with it and it's really killing me to be honest uh, but I'm just going to do it and it's so hard I mean I feel it's like something in my body it's like don't do that don't do that it's don't do that because <laughs> you see it's it's the fear of standing out I think this is the introversion thing the fear of standing out whereas the extroverts just stand out because they don't really care but I mean they do care but to a lesser extent than introverts introverts just are, are afraid of standing out you know on the street or you know in day to day life, in, in public and all that and that's the main difference between introverts and extroverts I think it's not so much that there isn't the anxiety and creeping fear and all that it's just the fear of standing out like you see, you see like charismatic leaders and all that why, why, do I, why are they charismatic, why are they so... why people look up at them because they stand out they do something that the others are afraid of doing, are afraid to do Right now, I'm. It's my hands are shaking. <laughs> this is so so strange. Even though I did it like three years and a half ago, almost three years and a half ago, it's something called the Comfort Zone Crusher, uh, and it's basically it was by an Austrian guy. It is by an Austrian guy called Till, and uh, there are a couple of challenges. Like one of them was to lay on the ground, and I did that with some people in uh, Trafalgar Square. And then I went on another street and did lay down by myself and it was interesting in seeing how people did not care if they walked around you or over you. Nobody asked me if I was fine or anything like that. Everybody just walked around and that was, that was interesting. That was like, huh, I don't really matter, do I? It was more like, it was kind of like that thought. And even though I did that a long time ago and I can probably still do it by myself without filming it this is different because I'm filming and talking at the same time so this is a challenge but I'm, I'm, I'm doing it I'm gonna lie down I'm lying down this is this is quite comforting quite comfortable and I see people are looking around at me, and that's that's cool because that's what they, sh they are doing. And if you want to do this, I recommend you do it because now I feel much, much more relaxed than I did like 20 seconds ago. And you know, it's just a thing. It's not that just a London thing. I've seen people in other countries do it, even Romanians, even yeah, Romanians because I'm a Romanian. I've seen people in Romania do it. Uh, I recommend you find the Comfort Zone Challenge group. There is a group on Facebook, and there is there are a couple of the, the, he has a website. And yeah, this is certainly different than going on stage. I'll tell you that much. I st I'm absolutely fine right now. These people are walking by. Some of them are looking at me, it's laughing. I'm just like I don't care. This is absolutely cool. Uh, but some of the other comfort zone challenges are um, you know, going around and asking people like uh, their favorite thing. And I remember walking around and asked, asked the biker his favorite five favorite colors and he told me some some of them. Some guy asked the guy if his five favorite dinosaurs and he told me his five favorite dinosaurs. Um, then I asked the guy in the suit like something and he was like, I don't have time for this crap. I mean, what a spoil spoil, right? <laughs> you know, it's been over a minute and a half, and I'm still fine. Um, yeah, comfort zone challenges are really cool, and this is a, basically a comfort zone challenge. And right now I'm standing out, because I'm pretty sure people are looking around, and I absolutely do not care. Um, <laughs> There's certainly a lot more to go to become more extroverted than I am, but this is very, uh, it's pretty much out there right now.
some guy just did a flip over me. <laughs> That's mental. Nice. See? Standing up. And I think this challenge is fine because it's been like two minutes and a half. And uh, this is probably a shorter vlog because I have nothing else to talk about other than Camel Comfort Zone Challenge and just feeling good. And this is a sunny day in London. This is probably the brightest period of London I've had since I've moved in this country. And I'm gonna enjoy it. And I also have a gig later on. So I'm gonna prep for that too. Uh, leave a comment or a like or something. Bye.